she is elegant, beautiful and successful. Thai princess Sriwan Vari is a famous athlete and fashion designer. She was called the hottest Thai royal. However, behind all this is a big family drama that happened in the royal life. Why did her father, King Rama X, drive her mother out of the palace with great disgrace? And why is her mother and brothers now living in the USA and only she was allowed by the king to return to Thailand? Keep watching to find out. This is WOW channel. Before we continue, make sure to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon for notifications. Let's begin! The Thai princess Srivanvari is an example of a successful modern woman. She is an equestrian and badminton player, but her real passion is fashion design. Her father, King Rama X, is the richest monarch in the world, with a net worth estimated to be between $30 billion and $70 billion. So the princess could afford to do nothing but spend time in a luxurious palace, travel and go shopping. But such a life is not interesting for the Srivanvari. She decided to devote her life to fashion design and continue the work of her grandmother, Her Majesty Queen Sirukit, the Queen Mother, who was engaged in the manufacture of traditional Thai fabrics to preserve the cultural treasures of the country. Much of my inspiration derives from my grandmother, Her Majesty Queen Sirikit, the Queen Mother, who in the past visited high mountainous areas in the northern region in order to help improve the quality of life of Thai hill tribe communities, said the princess. She works hard and presents her creations at fashion shows all over the world. For this reason, many people in Thailand love and admire her. The 36-year-old princess became famous for her talent and hard work. Also, in 2008, Srivanvari was included as 16th on the list of the 20 hottest young royals compiled by Forbes. However, looking at this successful, beautiful woman, many don't realize what kind of family drama she had to go through. Therefore, if you think that members of wealthy royal families don't know any troubles, then you are mistaken. Her father, Vahira Longkorn, king of Thailand, has always had a very controversial personal life, which was surrounded by various rumors and scandals. The first time he married in his youth was with his cousin on his mother's side. However, this marriage was unsuccessful, most likely because the wedding was organized by the parents. Vahira Longkorn did not love his wife, because he soon found a new woman. The young and very beautiful actress Yuharini became his mistress because the wife refused to give a divorce for a long time. For many years, the future king lived with the former actress as a mistress. However, this did not prevent them from creating a large family. In this relationship, they had four sons. And in 1987, the fifth child was born, the long-awaited daughter of Srivanvari, which we will talk about today. Only in 1993, he finally managed to get a divorce from his wife, and a year later, he officially married the mother of his five children. So, a commoner became the wife of a prince, she received the royal title, was appointed a major in the royal Thai army and began to take part in royal ceremonies. However, their happiness soon came to an end. Two years after the wedding, the queen consort had to flee to the UK with her children. While she was abroad, her husband accused her of cheating with a 60-year-old air marshal. The queen consort was expelled from the palace in great disgrace. The prince hung placards all over the mansion accusing her of treason. Who knows, if she stayed in the country, she might even end up in jail. Soon the couple divorced, the woman and all her children lost their royal titles. However, Vahira Longkorn decided to return his youngest daughter to the palace. He loved her so much that he could not let her go. A ten-year-old girl was abducted from her mother almost by force and taken to Thailand. 
Princess Sirvanwari got back her titles and continued to live in luxury, but she lost the most important thing – maternal love and communication with her siblings. Of course, we don't know the whole truth, but we can assume that it was a big stress for the girl. She has hardly seen her mother since then. However, Princess Srivanwari has become seriously interested in sports and then fashion design. She wanted to be the best in everything, probably because not to think about separation from mom and brothers. The princess went in for equestrian sports, played badminton and participated in sea games. She brought her country many awards and gold medals. The royal family has always been proud of her. In 2007, Princess Srivanwari staged her fashion show in Paris. Her debut collection was based on the memoir of her grandmother, the Queen. The princess also created a dress for the Thai entrant in the Miss Universe Thailand 2018 pageant. However, there was one scandal associated with this story. One Thai YouTube user called the outfit ugly. After that he was prosecuted, as it is forbidden by law in Thailand to criticize members of the royal family. Nevertheless, most of the citizens of the country love the princess because she has become a model of good taste and elegance. She also showcases Thai culture to the world. The princess has been working as a fashion designer for many years and collaborates with world-famous brands. I wasn't just a princess, I actually worked. Work means actually working. I was very hands-on and I wasn't the first assistant but the fourth or fifth, so I learned fast and I had to be tough," she said in an interview. Well, now looking at the rich and successful royal life of the princess, you should always remember that even in her life there were great sorrows and the loss of loved ones. Today her mother and brothers live in America, but the king of Thailand never forgave them. And we don't know whether the princess has the opportunity to communicate with them or not. As for the personal life of the Thai 36-year-old princess, we don't know anything about it. According to her official biography, she is not yet married and has no children. However, some people believe that Prince Martin from Brunei would be the ideal husband for her. Do you think they suit each other? Thanks for watching. Don't forget to share your thoughts with me, to click like and to subscribe. See you next time.